Hello, there's MacMass40 and 48 here. Today in this tutorial, I'm going to be showing you um, how to set up your server in just a, f a few minutes. The server can be accessed by um, anyone, u uh, anyone using the internet, uh, but I think you need to set up port forwarding to do that. And my route it says that I can port forward, but um, I think it's maybe my ISP or something that sets some firewall, so port forwarding won't work for me. Okay, also, um, if you don't want to uh, spend waste time port forwarding, you can just make the server website available to all people using your router. Okay, to, so to access this server, um, you'll need to type in your uh, IP address, um, colon, and the port. I think the port, I think you need to port forward 8000, but if that doesn't work, should find in Google in just about half a minute um, what the port is. Well, if find find out what it is, I'll post it in the description for you. Okay, so, um, this port will only be, a, you can own, sorry, I mean the server will only be, a, um, only work when your computer is on, is, um, because uh, what it does is it, um, for example, when you load a web page, it download, kind of downloads the web page, but doesn't exactly save it to your computer. So it downloads it from your from your computer. So I suppose your upload speeds need to be quite good um, to download stuff um, fast from it too. Okay, first to f um, find out your IP address, uh, go to a web browser and type in what is my my IP dot com. Got the link in the description. Also, you need software um, called Apache, A P A C H E. When you install that, uh, there should be um, something saying like, "What do you want your website name to be?" or something like that. I think it's above uh, an email. That's something that asks your email. Okay, so just write in local host there without a space. Now go to local disk, program files, Apache Software Foundation, Apache 2.2, HD Docs. Over here you might find um, an HTTP file, just double click on it, delete everything, no, I mean don't double click with it. Right click on it and um, open with text edit, you just click on edit or something like that. And just open, um, you can just delete the whole, delete everything there and just, if you know HTML codes, just um, write in the web's HTML code, so it's like design and links and things like that. Or you can just, um, when you go there, you'll just see something like this if you don't do HTML. Just some link to download the file uh, from there. So you want uh, to um, access this um, from another computer using um, your router, go to command prompt, uh, start run cmd. And when you're there, type in ipconfig slash all. Okay, over here should show lots of different things. All you need to know is IP address 192.168.0. Should show a number there. Okay, remember that and type that into a um, web browser and another computer using your router. Okay, so downloading you, it went. Um, but it does, I think it doesn't exactly um, access your access the internet and via your ISP. It just um, goes through through your router. So you could probably, if you connect um, some like ten thousand routers to your um, uh, ten thousand computers to your router or something like that, you could have like a second version of the internet or so, something like that. But that probably just crash the router. Okay, um, thanks for watching this tutorial. P uh, please subscribe to Mac Last 48 and um, uh, please rate, comment, and subscribe and favourite this video if you like it.